10 different exercises, 1000 reps, instant exhaustion, leg day. So that's surprising. Am I ready to totally die? I don't think so, but I will do it. And obviously I'm hungry and tired. So why am I doing this? I don't know. To challenge myself? Dreadful, that's disgusting. Because I love challenges, to basically die from sweat. Because 1000 reps is low weight, high rep <sighs> cardio. this part choosing the right weight because the ego is like yeah you can lift with that heavier weight yeah 20 or 25 sets <laughs> reps i don't think so but the plan four sets of 25 reps or five sets of 20. yeah right that was the original plan you'll have to see what happened yeah for one exercise die Okay, enough for the talking part about dying, let's actually die. And the first exercise starting with back squats, barbell squats. I hate them, but using lightweight, I didn't hate them. I, I really do hate back squats. I really hate squatting with bar. And using lightweight, I was like, oh my gosh, what is it? Why do you hate it? But yeah, basically for, for two first sets, I did a little bit lighter and then for the Two last sets I did a little bit heavier because I was like, um, it's too easy, even though I did 25 reps. So yeah, we're using extremely, extremely lightweight, uh, really lightweight. But surprisingly, it wasn't that hard because as I said, lightweight, lightweight baby. Okay, now looking back, it feels like it was easy, but at that moment I was out of breath because it's basically cardio. Nothing else than basically pure cardio. And I also decided to film how much time every exercise took. So basically, obviously, the kind little bit easier exercise will take less or if you do less um, kind of sets, but more reps. For example, that happened with hip thrusts. I used only two plates and I was like, oh my God, this is so easy. That was, I was like, okay, I can do 50 reps because at the start I was like, okay, I'm going to do 25, but actually it was too easy to do just 25 reps. Cause I usually uh, hip thrust three plus plates. And this, this was nothing. You could, can't compare it to three plus plates. Obviously my butt was burning, but it was like, so surprising how much I have progressed. Like seeing that, I remember like eight months ago, seven months ago, I was like dying. Basically my butt was on fire when I was using only one plate. And now using two plates feels like nothing. Three plates, yeah, three plates is 140 kilos. That's a lot more than 100 kilos, right? It's a di big difference. But then I continued on front squats. I really hate front squats and um, it, it's hard there to do front squats no matter what weight I use just because my wrists literally are dying. They feel like I they will literally break apart, but definitely after squatting, yeah, as you can see, slightly dying. Slightly really out of breath because as I said previously, cardio for a lot of reps, a lot of reps. Breaking news, got me breaking, 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 breaking. I was present, hopeless, praying, 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 praying. Struck down at 20, plenty left to pull behind you. You ain't peak, never speaking, not speaking about you, leave it alone. Hope you grinning while you watch your bros. On some sofa, sunny shit to brighten up a wounded soul. Honest, you the penny, uh, pick it down like Chevy. Uh. And then I decided I should do super set. Cause why not? Isn't it hard even? No, it definitely isn't hard enough to not super set, right? But like, I always super set something with something cough raises are always super set never do them just alone uh because i don't know that's that's me yeah definitely it's not as hard to not super set well that's just me i always do that to myself but um, continuing with the death the hate love relationship that usually always everyone has with aka bulgarians okay aka the og bulgarians split squad aka something that some people actually really like aka i don't know why i'm keeping me saying aka i used lightweight only take it 10 kgs in each arm literally 
Actually, it wasn't that dying. Okay, well, I was dying, I was a little bit dripping, but I usually use 16s, and that is, that is uncomparable. How did I even get this idea to do 1000 reps on leg day? Because everyone who knows, who do, does leg days know that they are disgustingly hard. But I got this idea from Tristan Lee. He's extremely like shredded young guy. But I also seen like Karen, Carolyn Gervan home workout, 1000, a lot of reps. But like, yeah, I saw him doing it. I made my own kind of 10 different exercises to do and I did it but uh, I wasn't doing it alone and when you're not doing it alone it's not as dreadful because the time goes faster I wasn't even looking around how many people are there I didn't even check I wasn't really checking the time that much only when I was like filming how much time has it passed but basically Walking lunges is always like my hands, again, my grip gives in the first because grip strength not really strong. Um, but yeah, walking lunges are never easy. I know a lot of people do them as a burnout. That was the eighth, eighth exercise. Because uh, anything that is with lunges is hard because it's single leg exercise. As you can see, that's how, how I always carry my dumbbells after work, after uh, leg like extensions. No, but after walking lunges because my grip is basically not existing. And then the last two exercises. I decided, as you can see from the reps, one set of 100 reps of leg curls. Because I, I started, I was like, okay, maybe I will do 50. But then I was like, I can continue. I can continue. And I will continue because that will be faster. And uh, it will end faster. Hamstrings on fire, but two of my favorite exercises, hamstrings and leg extensions. But basically, when I started doing leg extensions, I was in my fifth rep and I was like, why? It feels hard. <laughs> and I was using lightweight, like lightweight. So obviously, as I have done 900 reps previously, of course, my quads feel it. Of course, my legs feel it. Of course, my legs are tired. Uh, but yeah, I was making these faces. And if you're not making these faces, you aren't training hard enough. If you're looking on your phone when doing leg extensions, girl, bro, you're not training hard enough. Harder than last time. As Greg Dush says always, harder than last time. Train harder than last time. Did, that, did you hear it? Did I say it? Harder than last time. And it only took me two hours to finish it. Only two hours, right? So we just finished the thousand reps leg day. And not gonna lie, actually, not that tired. He. The body I was doing it with is a lot more exhausted than I am. Well, I can say that I am better at cardio, even though he did gymnastics. What is it? Um, rock and field. Rock and field before, and I kind of nailed it better than him. So that's surprising. But I also was using lighter weight, so I don't know if it counts. But I'm also a girl, and I'm not a power lifter. He's. And actually, I could do it again because it's not that hard. What do you think? Yes, but it was three years ago when I did track and field, so it has passed some time. Okay, I mean, it's fine, but I'm not that tired. My leg day, my quad day, I feel like it's even harder because it's like heavy weight. Heavy weight because this was low weight, high rep. But I mean, obviously, I'm hungry and tired, but it wasn't that bad as I was expecting. I feel like at that moment my endorphin levels were high high and I was underestimating aka okay, saying that it was really easy but it wasn't easy I just thought it will be a lot harder but it wasn't easy because anything come with leg days anything when you're pushing yourself really hard is hard and it was hard and for anybody who if you're watching this and if you if you try it it will be hard because it's leg day and thousand reps Maybe I should have uh, done with more weight, maybe, but then I wouldn't be able to do 
25 reps on some of the exercises for one set, but like, it's fine. I would rate it like 8 out of 10 with, diffi oh, with difficulty, maybe less than 8 out of 10. What do you think? Difficulty. Mm, 9 out of 10. Okay. <laughs> because it was a hard, a hard cardio. <laughs> For you, it is not out of ten. Then for me, it's like seven or six out of ten because it wasn't that hard. Like I will say it, it wasn't that hard. Yeah, that was the thousand reps. My leg day is harder. See you on my leg day. Bye. You should have done two thousand reps. You know what we thought? We I thought we should do thousand rep leg day with lunges only. All the lunge uh, um, variations. That that would be a lot. Horrible. Now I'm like, yay, thousand rep lunges, but like Bulgarian split squats for more than 100 reps would be that. Uh, With what? So, doing this thousand rep leg uh, day challenge, what was your favorite and what was your least favorite exercise? Well, definitely my least favorite. I don't know. As it was a high volume, it wasn't that dreadful, that disgusting, but uh, probably I don't like front squats. Bulgarians weren't, weren't that bad just because I was doing with light weight. Walking lunges? Front squats? My favorite? I really don't like hip thrusts, but as it was light weight, it went so smoothly because whenever I do hip thrust, I need to mentally prepare it because I'm doing with heavy, heavy weight, like three plus plates. Surprisingly, I don't really have any doms or muscle soreness or anything like that. Literally, my hamstrings are little bit tight, but it's probably because of 100 non-stop leg curls. But overall, try this and Comment down below if you've ever tried something similar or if you want to try this because I love challenges. Challenges are everything. And don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to. Please. Bye.